All right, hey guys, Buck Jock here. Welcome back to some Crash Bandicoot 2. Yeah, I was brilliant, and Aiden's here, and yep. I was brilliant because I never recorded my mic live. So this is post commentary for the win. Oh, <laughs> so last episode we did totally bare, which you haven't still caught up to. No, I'm still not even caught up. But anyway, Cold Hard Crash, the stupidest gem ever that I said I'd probably leave to last. I did, and you know, I had to cut out ten minutes of it. <laughs> you'll see. It's pretty bad. Anyway, beginning of levels pretty basic, as we already know. So, I don't know what I was doing. Probably talking, you know, because I do that. But, you know, not not anymore. Talking's already good. This is the whole reason this episode has came out super late, by the way. Because you were lazy. You didn't want to. Yeah, you really didn't want to do this. <laughs> Them seals are pretty OP. As the, as the, you know, self -exam. Slide around the ground. Yes. Bouncy. <laughs> Bouncy blubber nuggets. <laughs> That's what they are. They're blubber, aren't they? Yeah. Pretty much. Pretty much. Checkpoint. Those come yeah. into key in this level. It's really stupid. Yeah, I'll explain like when I get there. That's where I'll actually be talking a lot. But right now, it's just the basic level. It's all happy, happy fun time. <laughs> Boing. Ninja kill. Into the bonus. Like a pro. So I've already got one of the gems on this level, and that was not the box gem, that was the gem at the end of the death room. And the death room's the whole reason this took so long. Yeah. Secret secret one for the win. The one that always annoys people. Free lie. Of course they put the lights in the trolliest places. Trolley all over you. Da bounce, da bounce, da bounce, bow, 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 bow. Whoa, is that no one alive still there? Well, yeah, I mean, I just played totally bare. And normally, you're like so, so many lives on Crash I know. Bandicoot 2, and now it's like. <laughs> less than... You see Crash Bandicoot 1? <laughs> it's a lot. Anyways, <laughs> I'm not gonna talk about that. Okay, we're getting almost to the point here where Tricky Dick level part comes in. I just get so confused. Okay, here we go. Checkpoint. So, I need to get this checkpoint, and then I go into the death route. Uh, uh, because if I don't, then, you know, the death route is not going to be fun. Anyway, brilliant right there. Wow. I did that about 4,000 times, but it's all cut out, because I only, I only show you two takes for this entire thing. But it actually took, like, 15 to 20 takes. So what I have to do is I have to get all the boxes in this death route. And if I were to not have got the um, the normal gem, the other gem that I got already, I would get that too, which is at the very end. And then I have to get a question mark box to activate those and one box that I cannot get that I've already well, I'm about to pass, I think. No, no, I already passed it. But I have to go all the way through this whole death route and get that. How are those question marks now? Exclamation marks, I meant. You know, kill myself intentionally. And here's where we cut to ten minutes later. Literally, I looked at it. Ten minutes later. I come back. Come in, come in here. Get this. And then you have to go all the way back through the whole level. All without dying. Which is not the easiest thing. Because this is the hardest death in the game. So, not the best. Um, so it was not fun. It was absolutely rage-tastic. Too bad you can't hear it. But you know, you don't have to hear me yelling non-stop, breaking your ears, have to turn on the volume, so it's always good as well. Probably have enough of that anyways for the rest of the crash. Yeah. Too. Crash 1's not as bad, actually. I'm surprised how better I am at it. Considering it's harder, but... Crash 1 after this, by the way, guys. Didn't realize already. Somehow. So this is the only attempt I actually made it, so... I think I may have made it one more time and then died outside of the death route, which is horrible. Wow. So that's the only way to get all the boxes, so this is why this level is retarded. Okay, back to the normal level, which you've already seen, so you know, not too much new here, aside from all this holy stuff. Free life. You can see all the lives I lost. Not that many, actually, because I got lives every time I went in there, but... Yeah, I have to eat. Went a little bit better than I thought. It didn't take as long as I thought, but 10 minutes is still a long time. Yeah. I remember you did this this level before, and you were like, I don't know, it was like 
six boxes short or something? Where where were those boxes? Yeah, that was from? that was the death route. I I did it wrong. Like I got the gem, and then I died, and for some reason I never went back in the death route. I think. So all the boxes in the death route that weren't nitro, which is only a few, didn't count. So that was a rip. And then here's the the, the place where I cannot screw up the checkpoint. Okay, we're good. We're safe. Now I can die all I want, and trust me, I do. <laughs> now that I'm not so stressed out of not dying. I hate those stupid Sonic Hedgehogs. They're such bums. They are, in fact. You know the checkpoint. You can never tell whether they're gonna go spiky or not. Sometimes, like, it's like random. random. Sometimes they walk back and forth three times, sometimes two. You never know. Pointless, but, you know. Lots of apples. I'll for the win. So yeah, end of Crash Bandicoot 2! <gasps> it's insane! Oh, it's been a long and ragey series. Crash 1 would be just as bad. Well, not as bad, but I don't know. I can't. I'm not going to speak for it, so I don't actually remember. Yet to edit that. Yeah, Crash Bandicoot finally. Finally then. One of the little few series, all this troll, troll life. One of the few series that actually can end. Yeah. One <laughs> series that just, like, sort of... Just Unlike Minecraft and you know, that's pretty much the only other series. I mean, there's other series like Skyrim that I've not finished. I've just continued, but okay, we're finally almost done the level. 131 boxes. The whole amount of boxes. I was just checking if that was the one with the intro pick there. Yeah. Huh, this level has 155 boxes. I know that because there's a trick you can do where if you go in the bonus, if you go in the bonus and you exit the bonus after getting all the boxes, and then as soon as you get out, you die as the box counter is still counting down. Um, those boxes, all the boxes and most will still count towards your um, your total box count, and you'll be able to get all the boxes in the bonus again, and, or not all the bo bonus, but like all the boxes you destroyed um, prior to the last checkpoint. You know what I mean? Like, so you got a checkpoint, went into the bonus, got a lot of boxes, went into the bonus. I mean, and then you died right after the bonus. So all those boxes you put in Overworld are back. It's hard to say. <laughs> all the boxes in Overworld are back, so you can now destroy those and get boxes that don't actually exist. So you don't have to do the death route, but that's way too complicated and annoying for me to attempt to do that. So you have to get exactly 155 boxes. If you go over, then you won't be able to get the gym. So complicated but an easier way but still more complicated so yeah. I'm like nope we're gonna do it the hard way <laughs> just to make sure so yeah, I've already died once I don't know if I die again probably probably me a lot in this game surprisingly not on the PSP I'm not sure why maybe more easy yeah here's the here's last box here's the stairs box. that you never can get up yeah, I, I seem to never be able to get up these stupid stairs, I don't know why. We did it! Oh my gosh! The last gem in the game, 155! Oh, the game's over! 100%! Oh my gosh, it took so long! Actually finished. Holy oh my gosh! Oh, I don't want to get too excited here, because then my asthma starts making me get like, headed. But Cold Heart Crash is done! Oh! Okay. Here comes the final cutscene. Let's watch. I haven't seen this yet. You have acquired all of the gems. Incredible. Chris, I'm not the only means of harnessing planetary energy. Right. The gems have that ability as well. And with them, I can destroy the Cortex Vortex. Forever! <laughs> Thank God. Let me walk you to my complete laser installation. Hmm. Let's go. Let's teleport. <laughs> that guy's <laughs> a little bit concerning. <laughs> and and Bryn, and Brio, uh, he's a boss in Crash Bandicoot 1 for the record. He's that guy with a million health. Oh wow. Anyway, I went I went down just to see if I could go down, I think. I was, I was just showing off also. I went down all the crystals and all the gems! I was like, can I go down? Nope, I can't go down. Let's go up! Let's go all the way up! Infinitely! We've done that! Warp room! Bear it!
Hundred percent. We've done this warp room, the water warp room, sewer later for the win. We've done the. I used to call train track warp room, but it's definitely not train tracks. That warp room, and then the space warp room. Now, the final cutscene. Real final cutscene. Oh, what it changes after you've beaten it? Yeah, the one that you randomly did on my one, remember? Yeah. All the gems, guys! Oh. All the gems! Turtlewood's music. Oh, a lot of and gems. here comes the colored gems. The epic colored gems. Nope, apparently they don't exist. There they are. Stupid plant food gem. We are ready, Crash. Would you like to do the. That's a that platform from Crash Bunky 1 that went on fire. Are you standing on? That's really cool. <laughs> Yes, really. Nitrous Brio. Now roll the credits! In one second. You've done it! We've killed it! But, but you know. There's a glitch in. There's a glitch in little. I don't know. Just having fun in the background. <laughs> Created and developed by Naughty Dog. Naughty Andy dog. Gavin. What is it doing? I didn't even realize that. It's having <laughs> fun. <laughs> Looks like a diamond sword spinning in circles. <laughs> I think that's part of the emulator probably glitching it. Wow. It's like a little stringy thing in the back. You can't even yeah, stop that. It's like <laughs> something having fun spinning in circles just wow. infinitely. <laughs> and by the way, the island in the background of when we destroyed the lasers is Crash Bandicoot 1, so oh. That's pretty crazy. So, I think I missed it. Um, I, I stopped recording as soon as it happened, but at the end he's like, Seen the last of me, oh, 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 or something like that. So, um, that happens. But anyway, the rest of the footage is just basically completely pointless. So I'm just gonna stop commentating now. So hope you've enjoyed Crash Bandicoot 2. Yeah. Aiden has what enjoyed watching me rage, yeah. and um, we'll see if Crash Bandicoot ones is ragey. Until then, see ya.